Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to High School Romance. If you guys remember what happened last time, we were told we were a lesbian. I'm... <laughs> Ugh, I don't know how to say that. Because, well, we're a guy inside a... Like, dressing up as a girl, and it's like... Yeah. And also, we met the class representative. Our little shoji was going up. We had to find a way to bring it back down. And I hope we find out if we actually brought it down or not. So sit back, relax, and that sounds like a lot of weight being put on my shoulders. Shoji, you are 100% right. And let's keep on going forth. Um, what's that noise? That's the warning bell from the end of the period. After that... We only have two minutes to get to the next class. Oh, okay. Two minutes? Yeah. Shit. We have a gym next. Do you know where it is? No, I'm afraid I don't. We, we, I'm, I'm confused. Selena didn't show me the gym yesterday. And of course, she probably assumed I'd just follow my class. Again, that was a horrible tour then, Selena. I'll get you back for this. Actually, we're in all girls' school, so they probably think it's a new. Damn it! Ah, plan backfired. Let's keep on going forward to the future. See if I can take it then. You should come with me then. I, you don't want to be late now, do you? I just hold you back. I don't want you to get in trouble. Yeah, let's not get her in trouble. Don't worry, I'm sure you believe in me, if I tell them why, just as long as we don't make a habit out of it. Of course not. Oh crap, a man, man, man voice came out. Oh, of course not. She may speak a little formally, but I have the feeling that she really wanted to help me out. That's good. Oh no, we're at the gym and I just remembered. I'm not even supposed to have gym today. Oh, Shoji, uh. you good luck. Ms. Ron said something about going shopping. Oh boy. It's not like I'm looking forward to it or anything, but I don't want to offend her. Here we are. Ah, good morning, Miss Rowan. Good morning, Hoshi. Were you showing Shoji around? Oh, thank God you came over here to our aid and help us. Oh, thank God. Well, yes, indeed I was. You're not teaching class today. No, not today. Shoji and I actually have some forms to fill out. I see. I hope it goes well. Oh, God. Oh. Thank you for showing me around, Hoshi. Of course. I'll see you in class. Have a good day, Miss Rowan. And goodbye, Shoji. Come on, we'll sneak out the back. Ah, <sighs> Leia? You're gonna screw us over one day, aren't you? She's a principal. Does she really have to sneak around like this? Yeah, does she? Well, at least we made it out. So this is where the girls at the school must go to shop. So, how are you liking the new school so far? I, uh... I don't know. Enjoying being a girl? It hasn't been so bad, I guess. It's only been a couple of hours, and nothing catastrophic has happened yet. True, but at the same time... Remember, Shoji, our little Shoji was gonna go up once you saw the other girl. She, when she grabbed you. You Good thing you calmed down. <laughs> I'm not joking, good thing you calmed down. Ugh. Uh, see? It's just what she said when you stopped worrying about it. I never said I was too worried. Yeah, we'll get figured out someday. You look very cute in that uniform, you know. Like you were practically born to wear it. But I really wasn't. Oh, says who? If it's look good on you, I say wear it. And that certainly does look good on you. <sighs> I think I might be blushing. Shoji, don't fall for the compliments, man. Never fall for those compliments. That makes it even worse. 
Is there to get many this compliments from your principal? Maybe the principal likes us, Shoji. I say go for it. I'm going to take you to some of my favorite shops. This will be good practice for you, I hope. Once you make some acquaintances, some of the girls might ask you to go shopping with them. Now, you can you can have more educated opinions of your style and fashion for girls. Well, it's definitely a kitchen of some kind. Yep, here we are. Oh, behave. How about something like this? It's not so bad. Doesn't look like it, but just wait until later. See? It's basically a normal shirt, but it falls off one shoulder. A little girlish, but simple. Oh, this is a cute pattern, don't you think? It looks good since it's a bit of lace as well. How many of these are we buying? They're coming out of our wallets, so... And if she's helping us out, then that's good. But let's see what happens. Yeah, let's try all of them, of course. What? Here? Uh... Should we run away or should we stay? Obviously, hell do you know if you look good, very good or not? I don't usually bother with dressing rooms. I don't either, dude. We, I just get my I just get my clothes and just leave. I like pretty, okay, pretty much I buy them and then leave. Because I know they're going to fit me well. Why, why, why put them on? <sighs> Typical. Come on. We'll, find, we'll go find some skirts and trousers to go with these. Here, pick some of them out for yourself and I'll judge. Great. Another test. Ah, well, things can't go from bad to worse. Ah. Uh, I don't know what to pick out. There are too many options. I should probably go with something safe. Go with something safe, indeed. How about this white pleated skirt? Good eye. White goes with a lot of things, so it's hard to mess up an outfit with white. Huh? Maybe this isn't so hard after all. What? The window of attachment is huge! Shoji, again. Good luck. She really is into the shopping stuff. It's more tiring than I would have expected. But I think I've lost all sense of time. I think we both lost all sense of time. So far, she helped me pick out a few trousers and the skirt and some tops. Having to model for them was bizarre, to say the least. Shoji, you're a guy. You, you've never done this in your life, so it is pretty weird. But it wasn't terrible. And it's probably better that I have some girlish clothes in my dorm. Actually, yeah, you have to. Or we're gonna go lesbian over here, aren't we? She didn't buy them for me. Which was needless kind of her. Oh, so she did buy us for, for us. That's good. Shoji, you gotta repay her. A couple of bags of clothes should do for now. But I'm really pleased with what we found, aren't you? Um, sure. See, he, I think it'll be a great taste. Just give it time. Now to the next item of our agenda, the underwear store. Underwear? I kind of assumed that we're still going to wear briefs, yeah. I know there's one nearby, it's just a matter of fighting it. Oh boy, oh please no. Shoji? You're gonna have to wear girls clothes. <sighs> oh boy. I'm just gonna say this. The lingerie that you're gonna wear, they're gonna be. I don't know. I don't know how to say this. I'm guessing they're gonna be humiliated or depressed or something because they're being pretty much bought by a guy. Hmm. There it is. The sign is gigantic. How could you not know where this is? Were I don't know, Shoji. But good luck with the good luck with wearing girl underwear. Come on now, don't be shy. It's a good thing she's dragging me, since I don't think on my feet, would I wouldn't move on their own. And this, and the swim fashion still looks the same over here. Huh. I was gonna say, I thought it was gonna be full lingerie, but... Looks like they have a swim, like a swimsuit section over here in the back corner where nobody can see still. Alright. <sighs> the walls are absolutely covered in bras. There are only women here. Talking enthusiastically to each other between the, uh... Shoji. 
Ah, Shoji. Good luck. As a guy? Skirts or no skirts? I get the sense I'm really, really not supposed to be in here. You're not supposed to be in there. Miss Roman doesn't seem to mind, though. Aren't these cute? So... Lacy. We don't need to buy all that much here. Just pick some out the ones that you like and go try them out. I have to try these on here, too? Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm guessing your, your pride's going down a little, Shoji. That's what I'm guessing. Of course. How are you going to know if they fit? To be honest, I'm just probably grabbing anything. Come on, try something off this rack. Those ones are huge. I would have fit in one of those. I don't know. Well, you can always add some padding. It would definitely give you a little shapelessness. I don't know if I want to go that far. Couldn't we just say that I'm flat chested? Yeah, let's just go with you. Yeah, let's go flat chested. Ah, <sighs> good luck, man. I suppose it might be a little bit more risky, but it's not unheard of. I think it's good work. Go on, this just room isn't any different from the other one. <sighs> this is ridiculous. These are the smallest size cups they have for bras. I guess they're more for preteens than actual women. <laughs> Shoji, you have to put them on now. Wait, 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 at the same time, why do we have to put on bras? That's my biggest question. Uh, I know it's a little more risky, but I'd rather go for the riskiness than putting on a bra. Oh, oh what about this? What are you doing in here? Uh, Shoji. God damn. What? This... This is supposed to be pri private. My person was supposed to see me naked. Again, we can't see it, looks like. I pressed a lot of buttons before we play this, so I can see what kind of buttons we press. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot. Shift? Tap? No. Ah. I'm just gonna say, Shoji, good luck. Wait. Why am I even covering my chest? Why are you- Oh my god. I found this black lingerie set for special occasions. On a sports bar for gym class. Does she even care anymore? Ah. <sighs> yeah, try them out. Only if you do first, try on the clothes. Uh, can I save? Yeah, let's... Guys, I think I want to save first. Okay, guys and gals, I'm going to choose only if you try do it first. I'll try them on if you do first. I'm not sure why I blurred that out. Maybe I was thinking that if she wanted to see me naked, it was only fair that I would turn the favor. It was only after the fact I realized how wrong it sounded. Again? What? I don't know about that. I mean, this is a shopping trip for you. I don't have any reason to try them out. Just forget I said anything. Oh, oh I get it now. You want to see someone else try it on first, so you don't feel self-conscious. Shit! Uh, I guess? Shit! Well, in that case, I don't suppose I can hurt. Besides, I don't pass up the chance to try on clothes. Just don't tell anyone about this, okay? I'm just happy to have my own shirt back on. Ah, uh, good, good thing you have your shirt back on. But, is this one really gonna let me see her try on underwear? Okay, you can come in now. Uh, oh boy. Um, little Shoji, you gotta come back down. Okay, um. See. Yeah, I think that little Shoji ran up a little. Huh? Shoji, what do you think? W wow. She sure is busty. Why is she a principal and not a model? Well, she could be your model, Shoji. Oh crap! She's probably gonna spell me if I keep on staring like this. Uh, it's a very um. <laughs> what just happened? Your face is so red. Is that a good sign? Um, uh, probably yes. I mean, definitely. 
looks nice on you. Nice. With all my vocabulary, the word I managed to come up with was nice? You think so? Yes? Uh, don't turn like that. Well, I'm glad you like it. It's a bit small for me, but of course. J just a bit. Dude, just take it in. Just take it in. If that make you feel too uncomfortable with you dressed like that, it's easy to forget you're not really a girl. No, no I'm fine really, but it's really okay for you so to do something like this. Yeah, is it? Oh, it's fine, after all. My real underwear is underneath. Oh, I guess Miss Ron would know. Wait, I can see your underwear underneath the black panties. Does that mean Miss Rowan is wearing a thong? Oh. Okay, I did my part. See, there's no harm to shut down some underwear. It's a fact of life. Do you feel more comfortable with the idea now? Uh, we're still a guy and putting on girl clothes. Ugh. Don't be so shy. Do you know how bras work? If you don't, I can show you. I just think the strap is really easy. Come here, I'll let you practice on mine. Whoa! <laughs> what? Sophie, go for it. Be a man for once. I know you're just up as a girl, but you're... Uh, just, just go. Do it. From behind, of course. Don't get the wrong idea. Shouty, your hands are shaking so much. Are you really that nervous? Well, who wouldn't be? But there. See how simple it was? Just step back so I can finish changing. Please. My head's spinning, and I'm starting to doubt that all of this is real. Ah, I can get I can get the sign of her out of my head. It's like her afternoon just been burned into my eyeballs. Well, isn't that a good thing? You, you it's a, isn't that a good thing, Shirji? Because I say it's a good thing. I don't know about you, but I do say it's a good thing. How the hell am I supposed to get thrown in gym class after this? <laughs> hey, we gotta. Ah, uh, yeah, true. Staple it? Nah, band aid. You gotta use a bandit or something, cause... Ready. I'm still thinking about it. How about this one? Not so shocking, huh? And we're still blushing like hell. And we still have the same clothes on, and oh boy. You know, I'm just gonna say... Yeah. Anything she puts on on the store is going to be shocking. It kind of is. And sure, she just go... Just go for it, man. Just go for it. It's a bit tamer, but still stylish. Bright neon colors are really popular right now, so they're good for Jim, because they hold everything in place. She's just talking about it so casually, because we're a guy. Don't be so apprehensive. These are typical, everyday topics for a lot of friends. Once you start, sh start making some, you need to pretend they actually have some of these conversations. I don't know if I can do that. Yeah... I don't know how can we talk about girly things. We're a guy and... Uh... <laughs> Shoji. Uh... I can't see you as a man anymore. Since I've only lived with my parents, I haven't even heard anything like... Uh... I haven't heard anything like that before. Uh... <laughs> Mm -hmm. Well, when in doubt about something, just try to follow the other person's lead and agree. So, I just told you about my sports bar holds everything in place. What would you say to a girl who mentioned that? Um, I don't have much to hold in place. Good, casual, and modest. That might draw little attention to the fact that our girls are built up differently. They'll catch on, don't worry. Anyway, there's a specific reason I picked this out for you. This is the sort of things we wear for two gym class. So you should definitely get one. Shit! Now I've tried them both, aren't like we agreed. It's your turn. Wasn't there a third item you brought in? Yeah, wasn't there one? Oh, did you want me to try that too? You might as well, I mean, we've come this far, right? Yeah. Wow. So you like it. Wow. Well then, um... Um... Yeah. 
I think I, I think I'll show you can't take it anymore. At this point, I think I, I think I'll do anything she told me to. Good. Now it's your turn. Do I really have to? Okay, fine. It's not like I think I think it's gonna fit me anyway. It's supposed to, so I should be worried about the way how it looks. But I guess it really isn't so bad. If I'm pretending to be a girl, it does have to give me the shape that Miss Rowan was talking about. Well, how do you like them, Shoji? Is everything a good fit? It's great! Especially the items she picked out. I'll bet you have a good eye for these kinds of things. And guys and gals, we're gonna end it here with these kinds of things because, well, let this soak in. We're a guy, and we're letting this soak in all, in all on our, ourselves, basically. A guy dressing up as a girl with heavy laundry and everything, which kind of makes no sense. Either way, guys and gals, my name is Aaron Knight. If you guys like what you saw, hit the like button. Really help. Mo, really helps me out. Also, share this with your friends. Tell them, like, this is really funny because, well, what I've been seeing so far, <laughs> it's been pretty funny and kind of awkward. Sometimes, probably it's going to end down a little because we're losing our masculinity and it's not very good. Also, hit the little red button down there to subscribe for more videos like this. Either way, guys and gals, my name is Aaron Knight, and I will talk to you guys next time about our, my embarrassment stories, stories about dressing up as a girl. Until then guys, gals, I'll talk to you guys next time. Later.